My name is Dexton McEwen. I am 23 years old and I am pursuing um, a general construction level two. My name is Marissa Jeremiah. I'm from Tivoli and I'm 30 years of age. My name is Randall Barry. I'm 27 years of age and I'm looking forward for level two in plumbing. My name is Kevin Snagros. I am 33 years of age and the qualifications I am pursuing at this moment is construction level two. Within Grenada's working population, there are 75.2% uncertified but skilled adults island-wide. It is with this urgent need for a skilled and certified workforce, the Climate Smart Agriculture and Rural Enterprise Program, SIEP, has answered the call to support the assessment for prior learning program for young men and women ages 16 to 35 in Grenada, Karakou and P.T. Martinique through the Grenada National Training Agency. I came to learn about the program from, from a friend of mine. He would have done um, the same program as well. Two friends. Two friends and ad advertisement. Um, the reason why I chose to enroll in the program is to get certified. So one day I could own my own business. Reason why? Because there are certain companies that depends to hold it up. Well, the reason I choose to enroll is to follow my studies and to gain more knowledge and to better myself at the same time. What is assessment of prior learning? According to the Grenada National Training Agency, assessment of prior learning involves recognizing a candidate's previous certified and uncertified learning to ascertain his level of competence or qualification based on the national regional qualifications framework. Assessment of prior learning is a process which involves the identification, documentation, and assessment of learning acquired through formal, non-formal, and informal learning. This includes work and life experiences, training, independent study, hobbies, and family experiences. It is the assessment of uncertified learning gained through work, community, or leisure time activities. Assessment of prior learning is the means by which persons can reflect, identify, and demonstrate their range of knowledge and skills through a valid and reliable process. I was assessed um, excellent. My assessor um, would, have, would have done a lot of drawings, written, and oral um, assessment um, with us. Um, he would have went in details to explain um, why we was doing um, what we was doing. There was also um, a practical aspect towards the assessment, yes. One of the questions that was asked is uh, how to prepare the safety, the, the hygiene for the kitchen, and the assessment is, it was not easy. The, the look at the, the filament stuff which I did, we started with um, two showers, a bathtub and a toilet. With assessing with the tools, scaffolding, and how we go about in doing farm works and everything, I would say it was an exciting experience because there are certain things that most people don't know and as how I go along, I learn a lot. Why you should take part in the APL program? Become certified at the right level of competence in your skill area. Build your confidence levels. Identify your personal strengths and interests. Identify your knowledge and skill gaps so that you can be aware of which areas you need to develop. I would encourage a skilled um, person who is, not so, so, who is not certified to get trained and to, to get um, certified. If you're not, well, you're not in the program, I advise you to get in so you can get your CBQ and it will be out there to get a better job, to be more qualified in what area you're doing. Do not be afraid to persuade your dreams and follow your mind. Go get qualified.
Because with that qualification now, you can head out of the country and maybe work some, somewhere in another Caribbean country or you can go in Australia, America. You can even head to England, New Zealand, all these other types of countries right now. With that qualification, that will push you forward to rise to a new level. The Climate Smart Agriculture and Rural Enterprise Program through the Grenada National Training Agency has provided APL scholarship opportunities for skilled young men and women ages 16 to 35 in the state of Grenada with two or more years experience in a skilled area and who would like to become CVQ NVQ certified in the following areas. General Construction, Allied Health Geriatric Caregiver, Electrical Installation, Food Preparation and Cookery, Plumbing and Early Childhood Development. I am Dexton and I am a SAEP beneficiary. My name is Marissa Jeremiah and I am a SAEP beneficiary. My name is Randall Barry and I am a SAEP beneficiary. I am Kevin Snagross and I am a SIAP beneficiary. The SIAP program is funded by the Government of Grenada, International Fund for Agriculture Development and the Caribbean Development Bank.